section. It's that loud, raspy voice heard across the USC campus for decades. You got to cover down your diagonal. But now, after 50 years as leader of the Trojan marching band, Friday. Dr. Arthur C. Bartner's career is coming to a close. You know, you get a little nostalgia, a little, uh, you know, choked up about, well, this is coming to an end. So just, just this week, the last couple of days, it's starting to sink in. Bartner first arrived at USC in 1970 when the band was in what he describes as being in a state of disrepair. First of all, it was 80 strong. Second of all, it was all male. A lot of guys out of the 60s that were not interested in discipline at all. But that would soon change. Take a lot. Go. Take a lot. Trombo, take a lot. It should be run like a football team. It should be physical. You should be yelling all the time. Lock it in. Let's go, tenors. Lock it in. In the mid-1990s, I joined the Trojan Marching Band. Oh, there were memories. When we played with Fleetwood Mac in 1996, that's me right there. When we stormed the field after beating Notre Dame the following year, well, I was there for that too. Hey! But Dr. Barkner wasn't easy. You weren't fun. You were kind of a tyrant. Yes. He's he can, Back then, it was, it was more about changing the culture and making it really challenging. <laughs> now we're much, yes, we're still demanding, but it's much more kid-friendly, if you will. She cannot be wrong. After 50 years, the Olympics, Fleetwood Mac, all the games, what will he miss most? the students, no matter how much he yells at them. Hey, light it up, capsule, light it up! I'm gonna miss working with the kids. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm tough, I'm demanding, uh, but still, that's the fun part, and feeling that energy, you know, you, you can't buy that. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Click the ABC7 logo to subscribe to our Eyewitness News YouTube channel.